Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to another installment in our Retro Throwback series. And today, we are headed over to a baseball diamond for Super Baseball Simulator 1000. I'm pretty sure is what that means, which, you know, is a very clever uh, nod at batting a thousand or the way that batting averages are measured in baseball. Now, I don't play a lot of baseball. Uh, I don't really play baseball sports in general, but I uh, did play a little bit as a kid, and so we'll just kind of have to see how this game goes. And this is not me playing, this is just some of the tutorial stuff that goes around. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, get it loaded back up to the main screen, and let's hit the start button here. And let's just do a singular exhibition, one game. And I don't want to play through a full nine inning game, but I'll play through five. And hopefully things should go fairly well. Um, oh, it looks like you actually get different teams. But I don't know if they're actually accurate to teams that were available during the time. We're going to go with this one and this one. And let's go through uh, playing ball. Let's go to... I don't know. We're going to leave this at 50, just because I don't know uh, what these things really stand for. And then for a stadium, we'll go with... Let's go with the CB Stadium, whatever that means. And... Oh, you can, you can have computers play each other. That's actually really funny. Um, but we're going to go ahead and do just that. I think we're okay. I don't know that there's any real changes I needed to make to anything. So let's play ball. And I don't know. Okay, that's how. That's how that works. Gotcha. And that's okay. It'll take us a little bit of some getting used to the controls here. And let's just see. That's a foul ball there. And probably not the best inning ever, but we didn't completely get struck out there, so that's kind of fun. And I don't know what these are. Okay, so we do get some control over where we're meant to go. And it looks like we are going to have to oh, throw the ball already. That's weird. Okay. There we go. And we're just going to throw things in. It looks like... We're not going to see a score. Oh, that's... That's kind of bogus, but I suppose... We can... Figure this out as we... Continue. And... Uh, not the best, but we can get a... We can get one more out before we... Oh, come on. Come back in here. That's, that's just unfortunate. 
but we're gonna run in here, and that doesn't count as an out, I don't think, because it hit the wall. Oh well. Let's come out here to the outside and make this pitch. Oh, come on. That's bogus, if you ask me. don't really know what that means, uh, but he did get four runs, so that's not super great. And that's going to be out of bounds, which isn't particularly great there. That is, again, going to be out of bounds here. And he's going to catch that. Lucky sucker. Wow. That just... Not fun at all. And let's see if we can't get a hit on that. It looks like we did. But he's going to catch it. Yeah, there's no way. Wow, this just takes some getting used to, doesn't it? I mean, I understand the general concept here. But... No, don't throw it to second. Don't throw it to third. What are you doing? <laughs> and... That doesn't seem to... Really do anything for us... No, throw it to second, you dingbat! Okay. <sighs> wow, I just don't really care for this a whole lot. Baseball's just never been a game that really speaks to me. So, excuse me if I'm not having the best time with it. Maybe I should have done three innings instead. No! What are you doing? Throw it to third! I just don't understand. Wow, this is just abysmal. This is not a game that's meant to be played by yourself against a computer, is it? What the heck? Throw it to first base, you absolute... Wow. Come on. Catch the ball. Thank you. Was it really that hard? That's a first out of this inning. What are you doing? I don't like the controls of this. Everybody moves the same way. That's so bad. Yeah, no, I'm not surprised that they called a mercy rule because that was abysmal. I don't think that this is a bad game. I really don't. I just think that there are certain controls that are pretty jankety. And 
I don't particularly enjoy playing this against a computer. It would probably be a much more fun game to play in a two-person setting because then both of you are making errors and mistakes, but I just didn't have that experience with it. And that's fine that I didn't have that experience with it, I didn't need to. And maybe someday I will. But uh, I would advise you to give it a try if this is kind of your speed of a game. I myself grew up playing games like uh, Backyard Baseball by Humongous Entertainment, so that was a lot more of an engaging, fun game for me because I liked the controls of it and the power-ups and other things that you could have with it made the game a lot more fun and entertaining than what more of a vanilla baseball game would. But I'm not going to write it off and certainly wouldn't lead you away from playing it if you haven't had a chance to do so. It's just not a game that I expect to revisit anytime in the near future. But thanks so much for letting me take some time out of your day to hopefully tickle a nostalgia bone, if you will. And we'll uh, catch you in the next video. Thanks so much, and I hope that you have a fantastic rest of your day.